about a year ago, I bought this uh, Lincoln 12 volt uh, powered grease gun, motorized grease gun. And uh, I bought it at a yard sale for 10 bucks. And I bought it knowing that it did not have a charger. But I figured, uh, how hard would a charger be to get? And I got online, and they're between 40 and 50 bucks online. I just didn't want to spend any more, <clears throat> any more money on it, because uh, I'm not really sure if I wanted to keep it or if I'd even like a motorized grease gun. But uh, <clears throat> a friend of mine gave me a, a DeWalt 12-volt battery charger, which is what that battery is that went with this, 12-volt. And uh, it didn't come anywhere close to fitting, so... Uh, First of all, I cut the guts out of this, and then I had to turn the terminals in a direction where the battery would fit in them, and by golly, it's working. It's charging. So now, uh, I gotta do a little fine tuning on this and put it back together. Now I've got a, this is a $300 grease gun. Uh, 299 at Sears and I got it for 10 bucks and uh, the charger for free and who knows I, I may even sell this uh, the other day these are Makita uh, quarter inch drive drill drivers uh, impact drivers rather and they're brand new in the box and I bought two of them for a hundred bucks uh, came with the batteries came with the chargers and, uh, geez, I can't believe it. I don't know what I'm going to use them for. We're probably going to resell them down the road. But when you come across an incredible deal like that. And they're not hot. I mean, I went right to the guy's house. And uh, he lived in one of them high dollar, very high dollar subdivisions with gates and everything. He was a, a snap-on guy that was selling out and moving to Mississippi. Anyway, just thought I'd show you how, how you can... Uh, reconfigure things to work for what you want them work for ten dollar grease gun yes I got a flag here and that's the one I'm gonna eventually dispose of properly it was it was uh, fraying I put a new one up thanks for watching